we all come from companies with cultures and values, and many of them are similar, and some are uniquely different. One of the aspects of the PepsiCo culture that I joined many years ago was a, um, a belief that leaders develop leaders, and that part of how you're going to be evaluated as a leader in the company is who you develop as a leader. Now, other companies have other methods of developing their people, but that's historically been PepsiCo's uh, mantra. So I think early in, in many people's careers, and certainly was true in mine, you're, you're, you're much more focused in your, your own career, and sometimes it's easy to forget the importance of having that impact on others. But as time went on, as the culture of PepsiCo um, really took hold, um, it became really clear to me the role that, um, as a leader, that I had to develop the leaders of the future. And so uh, as things progressed, I took more, more and more of an active role. And probably the, the one piece of the development of leaders that I probably look back with now that I've retired seven years ago that I have the most uh, uh, fond memories of is the one week a year that we uh, brought middle management, high potential middle managers from across the company and we brought them in for a week, <clears throat> starting on Sunday at noon till Friday at noon. We spent 24-7 off campus, and we would spend that whole time working only on their personal and professional development. And I say personal and professional because it was 50-50. Gave them as much coaching and counseling and support on the personal side as on the, the professional side. And those sessions were... Um, impactful. In fact, we have one uh, PepsiCo executive in the room here today who, was, which, who, who went through that a number of years ago, and, and hopefully that was helpful to him as he uh, progressed. And the, I might add before I finish this uh, little discussion that uh, we had, over those five years that we did that, we had different speakers. We'd have five or ten speakers um, a day. But the one speaker who was th with us for five years and who was always the highest ranking speaker was a gentleman at my far left, and that is Don. And his discussion about ethics and character uh, had a huge impact on our company.